Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back. What a nice day it was here in middle Georgia. Even after we started out with the cloud cover and the fog, we saw things really heating up into the afternoon, back into the 70s and even 80s for parts of middle Georgia. And now we're seeing a little bit of patchy fog starting to develop across the area. We could see a little bit more by tomorrow morning. So don't be surprised if you see it out there as you're heading out on your way to work. But otherwise, temperatures have stayed pretty warm through this evening. 63 degrees out there right now. This is uh, around our normal high temperature is where we are for this evening. Dew points are in the upper 50s, so we keep with the humidity as we are heading into the end of the week. But today we did make it up to 81 degrees. That is a record high temperature for this date. The old record was 79 set in 1951. Like I said, 63 is normal for this time of year for our high temperatures. It's actually our low temperature from earlier this morning. So a uh, Pretty crazy weather going on right now. We're going to continue to see more of these 70s and even 80s possible as we are heading into tomorrow. So we're going to keep that heat around. 63 degrees right now in Gordon, Milledgeville as well. And seeing 63 in Warner Robins with 60 over in Montezuma. But as you take a look across the rest of the southeast, we got more of the same. We have 67 up in Atlanta, 64 in Knoxville and 50s over in Nashville. But a lot of these places to our north have been dealing with some shower activity for this afternoon and this evening. So what we have going on, we've got high pressure to our south. That's keeping things clear and keeping a lot of that rain away from our area, away from middle Georgia. You can see most of us out there staying mostly clear with the exception of some high clouds pushing in, but all the rain stays well to our north. And that's really going to be what we're seeing as we head into the next couple of days. So that high pressure continues to pump in more of that moisture, more of that humidity, but also will be keeping us dry for the next couple of days. We have the warm front just to our north tomorrow, but tomorrow should be a really excellent day. Partly cloudy skies even after the fog in the morning. We will see the rain holding off until Friday afternoon and evening. You start to see some better chances, especially in our northern counties as we are heading into Friday evening for some scattered showers, but we're really not expecting a significant rainfall threat. As we are moving into Saturday, this is where we see a little bit of a cool down, down into some lower 70s. You see that cold front takes its time making its way through, but we will be seeing a bigger cool down by Sunday, along with a better chance for some rainfall. So overnight tonight, we're going to keep some partly cloudy skies. We got the fog building in as we are heading into tomorrow morning. As we head through the rest of the day, more sunshine on the way. Highs warming up into the upper 70s once again. The record high temperature for tomorrow is 79. So we'll be getting really close to that one as we head into the afternoon. But Sunday is really where we start to see a return of some rainfall. So just around a quarter of an inch of rain expected as we move into Sunday. We get a break for most of it next week. However, by the middle of the week, we start watching this next system. As that gets closer, that's going to bring us the potential for maybe a few strong storms there Wednesday into Thursday. In just 10 seconds, I'll have a look at our seven-day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, good oil changes for life, plus a 20-year, 200,000-mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I-75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. And here's your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7-day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. Temperatures will be staying mainly in the upper 70s as we head through the end of the week. Just some really nice, unseasonable, warm weather, but we do have a cool down on Sunday with that better chance of rain back to the 60s. Once again, Wednesday to Thursday of next week where we're watching for the potential for some thunderstorms.